The Greater Accra Regional Branch of the National Democratic Congress is confident of winning at least 27 constituencies in the upcoming December 7 elections. The party aims to secure two additional seats beyond its target of 25 constituencies. Philip Nilati reports. The National Democratic Congress currently holds 20 seats in the Greater Accra Region, but hopes to increase this number in the 2024 elections. The party's chairman in the region, Emmanuel Ni Ashimo, says although the party initially targeted five more seats, it has identified two additional ones, increasing the total number of constituencies it believes it can win to 27. In a Channel One News interview during a street campaign at Rees Junction in the Greater Accra region, the chairman of the NDC in the region, Emmanuel Ni Ashimo, expressed optimism about the party's potential to capture the majority of votes in the region. He indicated that the campaign is part of efforts to help the ordinary Ghanaian better understand the 24-hour economy policy. Our target of the 25 seat, the agenda 25 seat, is coming on and based on the research and the analysis that we've done, we are even thinking of adding out two more. So we are looking at 27 and leaving nine to our sisters and brothers at the other side. So campaign is very, very warm. The party is well attractive in the Greater Accra region. We are ahead of campaigning strategies. We are ahead of the numbers. You could see this morning, we are here at a popular place called the Rich Junction. This is a two constituency joined together. So this is a boundary road to make sure that this time the campaign Greater Accra, it is, we've done it from the bottom to the top approach. We are selling the NDC. The 24-hour economy must be understood very well. So we are taking our time to explain to the people in the traffic. We've printed enough of the uh, frequently asked questions of the 24-hour economy. Two million of it for us to give it to the people in traffic, the market women. You can see that we also close the Madina market. Samuel Atamels, the son of former President John Evans Atamels, who joined the street campaign, urged the youth to come out in large numbers and vote for the NDC on December 7. This election is for us, the youth. It's not for the older generation. It is our future and our children's future. The youth, this election is for us. It is not even for John Mahama. It is for us, the youth. So we have to come out in our numbers, vote and protect our votes at the police station so that NDC and His Excellency John Drama Mahama can come out and implement policies that will favor us, that will bring us jobs. He's talking about apprenticeship programs. The women are going to get their youth, um, the, the women's bank. We're going to get 24 hour economy so that everybody can go to work, whether it is morning, afternoon, or evening, so that we can all have jobs to do to take care of our siblings, our parents, and take care of ourselves also. So please, all the youth, everyone, whoever you are, whether you are NDC, MPP, CPP, even those who don't know what they are going to do with this election, they should all come out, and for the betterment of Ghanaian youth, they should come out and vote. The National Democratic Congress in the Greater Accra region has stated that it has intensified campaign in the region to be able to win a total of 27 constituencies in the December 7 elections. Reporting for Channel One News, my name is Philip Nilate.